This is DP Thong reporting from an undisclosed location in Fairfax, Virginia to do an exclusive report on a local cult rumored to be headquartered right here. Members are enticed to the cult with a promise of a one night a week commitment. Each Tuesday, spouses and significant others are left alone as the women report to the local cult headquarters. Aided by members who flaunt their allegiance to the cult, we did our best to try to gain access. Excuse me, are, are you part of the organization that me, that meets here? You bet that I has am. the local meetings? We uh, we have rehearsal every Tuesday night. It's great. You oh. Should, you should come. You want to come in? Oh, oh, come I on. could come, come in. Come on, come oh. on, sure. Oh. Well, it's, it's super. It's really good. We oh. have a great time. We, we sing. You hear these overtones. You know, oh. it's really cool. Wow, it looks like it's we're going to really, gain come on, come exclusive on, access on, to on, one of the on. local cult meetings. This is exciting. This is exciting. Right away, we were able to identify what appears to be the cult leader. And, as expected of a cult, there was much possessed speaking of tongues. But the members hypnotically follow the leader's waving hands. It's as if with only the suggestive movement of her hands, the cult leader can influence the group to start singing, stop singing, or increase and decrease their volume. The group is at her service, forced to produce musical notes audible only to the leader. And when she hears these tones, she tauntingly points to the sky. And despite capturing this heinous and exclusive footage of the leader striking each member, the leader maintains an extremely positive reputation with the group's members. However, it does seem to be a peace-loving cult. And the members do seem to be having a rather enjoyable time. But part of this phenomenon is indicative of all of cults and the methodology and tactics they employ to recruit other members. We've brought in an expert on cults, Dr. Norma Lee Lucid. Doctor, what can you tell us about cults in general? <gasps> well, Diphthong, there are so many fascinating things about cults like this, and I've studied them thoroughly. Of course, I've studied them so much that it almost feels like I'm in one. Ha 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 ha! But these cults are very powerful. They are methodical and they are deliberate. Some cults prey on younger victims, luring them away from their youthful innocence and playing on their naivety with the promise of sisterhood and a sense of belonging. Many of these organizations target the mentally questionable, seeing them as easy marks to join the cult. My research has shown a plethora of mentally questionable seeking and being granted membership in this particular cult. And once they're in the cult, they stay. And how long have you been with this organization? Oh my gosh, I, I lost count. Uh, I really did. I, I joined Sweet Adelines when I was pregnant with my um, third child, and I'm trying to think. Uh, it, may, it may be close to 150 years by now. 150? Pretty close to that's, that. That's a long Maybe time. 147, I'm not uh, sure. Okay, well, close thanks for rounding up. That's awesome. Thank you so much. Okay, thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. Well, it seems like if they're willing to stay, the organization can't be all that bad. Yes. Well, there are many positive benefits to this type of organization. <clears throat> Excuse me. Where was I? Oh yes, the positive benefits. Cults fulfill the universal human longings to feel secure and protected. Cults like this one here in Fairfax allow these members a meaningful life and allows them to be taken care of and feel protected and secure and to really find a home. Excuse me, excuse me. Yes. What's, what's the name of this organization? Uh, we're the Fianna Falls Chorus. We sing four-part acapella music in a barbershop style. And, and why do you enjoy this organization? 
we get together and we sing. We do what we love and bring that, bring us together. It's a pretty phenomenal thing. Cool. Isn't there something else you'd rather be doing on Tuesdays? It's Tuesday. This is my chorus night. What else would I be doing? All right. Thank you very much. Well, there you have it, folks. This has been exclusive coverage of the Vienna Falls Chorus from Fairfax, Virginia. This is D.P. Fong signing off.